Scary moment the other day when Steven Strasburg only able to go two innings, Dan, in his last outing, gave up the one hit. A busy day for Paul Lassard back and forth on the field. And uh, Steven left the game when he said for precautionary reason. Now we're going to see if we can get an update from Dr. Dan Coco on the latest now in Steven Strasburg. Dan? I do not have a medical degree, Johnny, <laughs> and I will try and do my best to get through this without screwing anything up. But what the Nationals are saying now is Steven Strasburg, it's not a ton, but they're saying that he had a nerve impingement, which has been alleviated. So that's obviously a good thing. And another good thing was that Strasburg was out in the outfield here at Nationals Park a couple hours ago throwing all off flat ground. Obviously, he wouldn't be doing that if his arm was still bothering him. What he said after his start the other day on Sunday was that over his last couple outings coming out of the All-Star break, he's felt kind of some stiffness, some achiness in his forearm that hasn't really loosened up. It did that first start out of the break as his appearance went on. The other day uh, on Sunday, it did not really loosen up on him, and so for precautionary measures, he decided to come out of that ball game rather than risk pushing through it and it becoming something uh, something more. Strasburg has said that he wants to pitch deep into this season, be there for this club September and October, and so kind of a precautionary thing, him coming out after two innings and seemingly a good sign earlier today with Strasburg throwing. Dusty Baker uh, earlier today giving reporters a little bit of clarity on the situation with Strasburg, saying he talked to his right-hander and seemingly coming out of things okay the other day in Phoenix. I spoke to him today and asked him how he's feeling. He said he was feeling, he was feeling good. And uh, you know, how, you know, whenever something happens, especially when you kind of have a history, then everybody gets a little alarmed. But you know, he's not alarmed. He doesn't look alarmed. Uh, he actually looks very at ease and at peace, actually. So we'll monitor Strasburg from here. Could potentially make his next start if everything goes well. More good signs here. Trey Turner out on the infield earlier today during BP, taking some grounders. You see that brace on his broken right wrist there. So still not throwing, not doing any baseball activities involving that right arm. But Trey has been down in West Palm Beach, kind of getting his conditioning in, doing some lifting, keeping his lower body in shape. And now back with the team was due to have an X-ray this afternoon to kind of see how that broken bone is progressing. We'll monitor Trey over the rest of this homestand as well. Also some good news on Michael Taylor, who was out here doing some sprinting and some light running as he comes back from that oblique issue. So a lot of kind of walking wounded, as Dusty Baker called it earlier today, Johnny. A lot of nationals working through a variety of injury problems, but they're hoping for the best with Steven Strasburg, Trey Turner, and Michael A. Taylor making slow progress as well.